Welcome back to my channel, Dave here, and today this this painting I'm using my hake brush, um, something that I'm still trying to get used to. Uh, I think I'm getting there. So today's painting I just wanted to do a loose uh, sort of landscape, and I wanted to add atmosphere into this painting. So I've got the board slightly more of an angle this time. I want more movement in the sky in particular. And I've just gone ahead with a, a, a light mixture of yellow ochre. And I'm just adding in the mix of Payne's Grey and French Ultramarine. So I'm letting that sort of mix together and come down the paper itself. And I'm just smoothing off here and there. So I want a bit of an atmosphere in this scene. I think one of the things that I do need to get hold of is what they call a butcher's tray. Uh, something that I can use with, especially because the hake brush is quite a large brush. It's quite difficult, if you can see, um, dipping into my palette, uh, especially because they're only half pans. It's quite difficult to get enough paint into the brush itself. So I think a, a butcher's tray would be best for that. So I would suggest if you do use a hair brush, to use a maybe a bigger tray, something where you can get a decent amount of paint onto your brush. One of the really useful things with the Hague brush, because it's such a large brush and it holds quite a lot of water, is you can't really go too tight, you've got to paint loose. But also it, it's good for lifting, which you can see, just dry out the brush, wash it out, dry, uh, squeeze the excess water, either with a tissue, and then just run it over the surface and you can do this where you can lift out some of the paint so for water as you can see um i've just pulled out some of that pigment just to give me a, a nice um lighter area
So now the birds are put in, I'm just going to remove the masking tape gently so I don't rip the paper. And that's a completed painting. I hope you like this one. Um, how to create an atmospheric painting with nice sort of movement in the sky. You got that nice distant hills and some trees and a bit of water. So I hope you like this painting. Um, feel free to leave a comment. Please give us a thumbs up. If you like this uh, video, please give it a like. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.